Hi, this is Sahana. In this video, we are going to learn how to implement search functionality. This is our home page. I will click on list all employees. Here we have list of all the employees. In this page, I would like to implement search functionality. Let's see how to do that. This is index view. Let's start with the design first. Let's expand views folder. We have employees folder. Inside employees, we have index.cshtml. In this index view, here we have a heading. Next, we have a table that displays all the employee records. Below this heading, I would like to have a search bar. I will add a row. Inside this row, I will add two columns. This is first column and I will add one more column. Now, I will add this. We have a form, then we have input field whose type is search and we have a button. This form will be handled by employee controller and index action method. In the second column, I will add an anchor tag to display all the records. Let's see how does it look. It looks like this. Now we are going to modify this index action method. This is going to receive search string. This will take a parameter search string. We are going to keep this statement as it is because we need to fetch all the records from database. Next, we are going to check if search string is not null or empty then then we are going to search for the records that match specific criteria here we are checking whether the first name contains the search string or the last name contains the search string if so then we are going to store that result in employees then we are then we are returning the result to the view it is that simple it's time to test these changes i will type s i will click on search by name see here we have a record if i click on back to full list we get all the records if I say RA, then I get two records back to full list. I'll type something random. I'll click on search. See, we don't get anything. Again, if I click on back to full list, we get all the records. So we have successfully implemented search functionality in our application. That's it for today's session. See you soon in the next video. Thank you.